Lighters up, Leo. It's your girl, the Stoner Girl Tarot. And I'm back with a special reading. This is your full moon in Capricorn, strawberry full moon prediction reading, Leo. This is a reading for the collective under the zodiac sign of Leo. Okay, so everything may not resonate, but that's all right. Just take whatever applies and let the rest fly. If you haven't already, light up with me, roll up with me. I'm almost done with this blunt. Drop me down. Drop me down. <laughs> drop down in the comments, y'all, and let me know what you're smoking on. If you don't smoke, no problem. You're still more than welcome. All right. Now, I have already shuffled these cards off camera. And so now I will cut these cards on camera. I hope you all are doing safe and well. All right, Leo. Bottom of the deck, Eight of Pentacles. Very focused energy for you, Leo. Some of you may be working on something very hard. So what is the super moon, strawberry moon bringing, Leo? Ooh, new love. Tell me more. Someone may be coming back in an uncondition unconditional, unconventional way. This is someone, <coughs> excuse me, this is someone um, who may come and offer you. Basically, this person is with the shit. They may only want something casual with you. Um, they may not want a traditional relationship. They may not be looking to get married. This person is definitely coming back. So, um, but there is betrayal here. What is the seven of swords about? Someone could come across or you could believe that they want a relationship, but they really want sex. Or they don't know, I'm hearing they don't know how to handle you. Um, but they, you or your person, there's like a sexual overtones here. They may, the betrayal or the deceit may be that they want to start a relationship. For whatever reason, I'm having issues talking. Like my throat chakra is... And I'm getting all this downloaded information and I'm high, but that makes it all the better. Anyway, so Leo, this person, the deceit is that they're trying to make it seem like they really want something substantial. They are looking for something serious. But right now, I feel like they're either just horny or they have no intention of settling down right now. Like, they may not be a player. They just may not be looking for that. But they're not being totally honest. This is someone who could have... Um, they could be making you feel confused right now. They may have made you want to become a uh, Sherlock, a detective, and go searching for shit online to try and... Um, fill in the gaps like you feel like they may not be telling you everything leo or this is how they feel about you and so this is making you right now feel very apprehensive very hesitant about um starting anything with them or just in the situation as as it is, you may not, you don't want to be a, an option. You want, you know, you want something substantial. You want something real, something stable. Um, could have manifested this person back into your life. Could be dealing with an Aries. Um, you could, yeah, because you can't let go you feel like maybe there's unfinished business because there it things came to an end. You I'm here for some of you, you may be blocked. 
this has caused you to go into you had to go into a healing you may have had to withdraw from a lot of people you may have been devastated and hurt over a message that you got or didn't get or an apology that you feel that you're owed this person always treated you like they just didn't know what they want it's like they didn't they weren't sure about you you got tired of um being on and off of this person you wanted success with this person leo you and the the obstacle is that okay you see or you're realizing that this person is always going to be up and down hot and cold with this person i'm getting a lot of that energy today for these readings but you're tired of like this person not being sure about you so you're choosing yourself this is your card the sun card um this could be someone that you have children with you're okay with just being cool with this person for some of you i feel that it's like oh, okay well you could have just told me that in the beginning. I'm hearing that for, for some of you. You could have just told me that in the beginning. You didn't have to lie to me. You didn't have to lie to me to kick it. They didn't have to lie to you to kick it, Leo. We could have been friends. You know, you just could have let me know what it is that you wanted, you know, because I'm focusing on me. You know, some of you are not really looking to jump into something serious right now you may have just wanted companionship some of you there is a deep connection i think i said earlier you may have been friends with this person so you may feel like this this draw to this person this pull to this person it's like intuitively you feel that you could have success with this person but again i'm feeling that this person just won't act right or they don't want to act right and so you're looking the full moon is bringing you new love yes i do feel that this person is coming back if it's resonating with you so far but i do feel that you will tell me tell me about this ace of cups Yeah, you want something new. You want to start a new chapter with something substantial. I feel like you're going to have a choice. Someone new and someone from the past. What's the outcome? Unable to make a decision. You're in your head. You feel like someone may be playing you, manipulating you. They may be focusing on someone else again that's your card leo so you may have to like you know know who the hell you are and cut this person off because you're like i like you but i don't i don't even think this person has necessarily Yes, I think they have disappointed you because I don't think they were being sincere and genuine about their intentions and about what they really want. Yes, that's how I feel. But I don't feel that it hurt you to the point where like you're in a deep depression. Like, you know, you're getting over it. You're you're healing. You 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 recognize it for what it is. But you're like, no, nah, I'm not going to. We can be cool, but I'm not getting ready to go through this. So I'm going to cut you off. What's the advice? This player is definitely going to come back around. Um, again, Sagittarius energy. Sagittarius has been in the majority of these super moon readings. That's hmm. you definitely could be dealing with another fire sign, Leo. But yeah, it's like see this shit for what it is. Like this person don't want what you want. 
you gonna cut them off. You want to. The advice is to, you got to stand firm, basically. You got to stand on your fucking decision, Leo. Like, that's pretty much it. Drop down in the comments to let me know if this resonates. And I'll see you later.